Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this fishman animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So, vectors from freebit.com, I will add download link and project files. First step, let's select this layer 1. This is left hand. And go to solo. Select pan behind icon. Let's click this icon for black background and move the anchor point here. Click selection tool and on solo. Select this layer 11, go to solo. Again, select pan behind icon, move the anchor point here. Click selection tool and on solo. Select this layer 111, go to solo. And select pan behind icon, move the anchor point here. Click selection tool and on solo. So, let's make links. Select this layer 1, link to layer 11. Select this layer 11, link to 111. And let's select this layer 111. Let's link to body. Select body, go to solo. Let's select pump behind again. Move the anchor point down. Click station tool and on solo. So in this time, select this modes, eyes and eyebrow. Let's link to heat. Select heat. Let's link to body. Let's select this here, go to solo. And select anchor point, move to here. Click station tool and on solo. Let's press air and let's see how to work it. Okay, let's select palm behind icon. Move to here, anchor point. Let's try chain rotation. Okay, let's move to left. And let's see. Nice. Let's move to here, anchor point. Okay, very nice. So, let's select this hand one. Let's see. Okay, go to solo. Select anchor point, move to here. Clearization tool and on solo. Select this hand two. Go to solo. And let's move the anchor point here. Go to click on solo and let's link to hand one. Select hand 1, let's link to body, click station tool and select this body, let's press R and let's see. Okay, very nice. Let's select this main object, let's link to hand 1. Let's see, select hand 1, press R. Okay, nice. And select this object 3, let's link to hand 1 also, let's see. Okay, very nice. And let's select this layer F2 or F1. Let's link to main object. Let's see, select hand 1, press R. Okay, very nice. So, in this time, let's select this layer 1, 11 and 111. Go to window, open Duik Basil 2. And click this icon for go to rigging. Click auto rig IK. Okay, we have new controller. Let's see. Nice. And in this time, let's select this F2 layer. Let's link to controller. And select pump behind. Move the anchor point here. Click station tool. And select layer F1. Go to pan behind, move the anchor point here, click station tool. Let's see, select F1, press R, and let's see, okay, nice. And select this controller, let's see, okay, nice. So, in this time, let's select this layer F1, and press R, make rotation chain frame, go to 10 chain frame, for shortcut, you can use hold shift press page down in the keyboard and let's chain rotation like this and go to 5 chain frames, make new chain frame and go to 10 chain frame again chain rotation back again go to 3 chain frame, make new chain frame for static chain frames and again go to 10 chain frame chain rotation like this Okay, and let's select chain frames, make easy. Let's see. Okay, so select this controller, 
and press P make new passing keyframe and go to here let's move to right let's see okay select keyframes make easies okay and in this time let's move to right and go to here make new keyframe for static keyframes and go to right let's move to behind let's see okay and in this time let's move to down okay let's move to left this keyframe okay go to here again make new keyframe and go to last keyframe and move to right like this okay let's move to down let's see okay let's add new keyframe here and move to right okay let's see nice and in this time go to some keyframes make new rotation keyframe for f1 and go to here let's change rotation like this and go to here make new keyframe for controller and go to here let's move to down and go to back let's move to here and move to up let's move to up here okay nice let's see nice and in this time go to three keyframe one two three make new keyframes and select all keyframes without last keyframe and control c and control v also select these keyframes control c and select this control v okay we have problem with this keyframe let's see okay let's select this keyframe delete and this delete okay let's select keyframe moved up here and go to here move to left and move to right here okay nice let's see so nice let's click for close doing basil window and in this time let's select this here and press air make rotation keyframe go to 10 keyframe let's change rotation like this and go to here make new rotation go to 10 keyframe chain rotation like this and go to here make new rotation again go to 10 keyframe chain zero and let's move right and select keyframes make easies then go to here for bones effect let's hold shift press p make new passing keyframe and go to center let's move to down this here go to last shape frame select first shape frame control c control v and select shape frames make easy let's see okay let's say shape frames move right nice select shape frames control c go to here control v and go to here control v okay nice so in this time let's select these eyes and press S, click this icon and go to here. Make scale chain frame, got three chain frame, one to three, change scale five, got three chain frame again, one to three, 
change 100 select chain frames make easy let's see okay select scale chain frames control c and go to here control v and here control v let's see nice and in this time select this eyebrow let's press p go to here make new passing chain frame and go to three chain frame one two three let's move to up and go to here make new passing chain frame go to three chain frame one two three move to down and let's make random animations let's go to here make new eyebrow chain frames go to two chain frame move to up and go to here let's make again some chain frames and make chain frames easy let's see okay let's select chain frames for eyebrows hold alt move to right for slow animation and move to left let's see okay not bad so in this time let's close this chain frame settings and let's select this controller let's link to hand one select hand one let's press air and make rotation chain frame go to 10 chain frame let's change rotation like this and go to here make new rotation chain frame go to 5 chain frames let's change rotation like this and select chain frames make easy let's see okay nice and go to here make new rotation again go to 10 chain frame chain rotation like this and go to 10 chain frame change again like this so this random chain frames you can make your chain frames how to like you okay let's see okay not bad so select body let's press air and let's make body animation go to here make rotation chain frame go to 10 chain frame chain rotation like this let's see okay and go to here make new rotation chain frame and go to 10 chain frame chain rotation like this okay select chain frames make easy let's see okay nice dynamic animation Let's go to here, make new rotation, go to 10 chain frame, change rotation like this, and go to here, again make new chain frame, go to 10 chain frame, chain rotation 0. And let's make bones effect for body, go to here, select body, hold shift press P, make new passing chain frame and go to center. Let's move to down this body, go to here, select first chain frame, control C, control V and make chain frames easy let's see okay select chain frames control c and go to here control v and here control v and here let's say again nice let's say chain frames hold alt move to right and move to right these chain frames So let's close chain frame settings and in this time select this bot and control D for duplicate. Let's move to up, press T, change opacity like this and go to mask tool. Let's mask this part like this and change opacity 100. Let's change like this okay nice so select these layers foot right one and go to solo save palm behind icon move to anchor point here click session tool and unsolo and let's make random animation press air let's hold alt click this icon for open expression let's write here wiggle one and six click this empty title for done expression let's see okay nice and let's edit this expression ctrl c 
select this foot layer, go to solo and move the anchor point here. Click station tool and unsolo. Go to first second, press air and hold alt click this time icon for open again expression and control V. Let's see. Okay, nice. So let's press N for select 5 seconds and in this time back to project and let's select this fishman let's move the inside for create new composition and select the lake move to inside fishman to composition and press S change scale move to here okay nice So select this fishman and press P, make new Python keyframe, go to 10 keyframe, let's move the up, go to 10 keyframe again, select this keyframe, control C, control V, select keyframes, make easy. And select this fishman, hold shift, press R, make rotation keyframe, chain rotation minus 2, and go to here, change plus 2 and go to here, change again minus 2. Okay, select keyframes, make easy. Let's see. Okay, let's select keyframes, hold Alt, move to right for slow animation. Okay, so let's hold Alt, click this time icon, go to play button, property and loop out duration for use expression. Let's see. Okay, let's make someone for rotation. Hold Alt, click this time icon. Go to play button, property and loop out duration. Let's see again. Okay, nice. So, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.